My name is Tom Hagerman and I write music and I am a musician. I am originally from Colorado Springs. I grew up down there and, uh, and then I went to Boulder for school. I went to New York for a little while. I came back to Denver and I've lived here for 22 years or something like that. How many instruments do I know how to play? I am sort of the jack of all trades and the ace of none in some ways. I, I play violin to some degree very well, as some would say, and I play accordion halfway decent. I can play a little guitar, I play piano. Um, I don't play most things that you blow through necessarily unless it's like a kazoo. <laughs> I can usually make a sound out of something if necessary, especially if I have time to do it at home and record it versus getting thrown in front of a bunch of people and trying to play something. So I've, I've loved everything I've done here. Everything is, it's great to be a part of the DCPA where the production is just the caliber and the actors and the costumes and everything that everybody brings to the table is so good. Uh, it's really fun to do and I'm very happy to be writing the music for Much Ado About Nothing. The process behind writing the music for this was interesting because I got to thinking um, Denver has this really robust tango scene and I have a love for Nina Rota music and um, sort of his Fellini film scores and there's an element to tango that I love and it's that just like the characters in Much Ado About Nothing they have I'm going to say a love-hate relationship between the characters they love each other but they kind of hate each other and there's an element to tango which sort of personifies that through the dance it's kind of a cold dance but it's a really sensual kind of sexy dance <laughs> at the same time so that there's this very kind of rigid posture but at the same time um, within that rigid posture and the the um, sort of tr trying to keep your partner away from you but close to you at the same time I, I think it's the perfect metaphor in motion for the emotional dynamics that are happening within the play. I enjoy the novelty of new productions and of um, the challenge of sort of taking a situation and working with it. 